Hello and welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here. Just waiting for the players to emerge and we will be underway. The teams then, Getafe against Real Madrid. I'm Peter Drury and this is Jim Beglin. Hi Peter, always good to work with you. I'm really looking forward to this now. Two starting lineups. Away. Long and high towards the flank. He's made sure that that won't get through. Chance! Crosses in a low one. And that's not the cross he had in mind. Casemiro. Isco. Cristiano Ronaldo. There's a look to the possibilities, but in the end it's fruitless. It's a long forward pass. Looks to slip it through. Gets good distance on it. Getafe are playing with a pleasing width here, especially that front line. Is it working for you? Um, it's not movement for the sake of it. Um, yes, it is working for me. There's a purpose to, to create space. Now the pass. Big chance here. Goal! Real Madrid! And Real Madrid are ahead. Yeah, look, let me tell you that when you're receiving a ball from behind, when you're on the move like that, can be very tricky to negotiate. But technically, I think he got that right. The finish was beautifully composed. Real Madrid take the lead, 1-0. Listen, when it comes to goals, Peter, in this team, he's always the number one contender, and he's done it again. He's off on a marauding run. It's a goal! And already they're looking to run away with it. Really outwitted one-on-one. -on -one. Once more, he gets the better of the keeper. Peter, I can tell you, that was nothing short of a cold-blooded execution. Real Madrid get themselves a two-goal cushion. That second goal has such a, a polarising effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. Aimed long and direct. Out for a throw. Samiro. No question, that's a foul. Casemiro. Looks like a good ball through. Isco. Great build-up. It all deserved a better ending. 
think there's always that danger that the defence can get exploited in that way. That must have served as a real wake-up call to them. Ball's loose, who's getting there? More and more and more and more! They are running riot! Hot knife through butter! They have done it again! Great reactions in front of goal. He just saw what was on. Well, for me, that's just pure predatory brilliance. It's not so much the finish, but the way he read the situation when nobody else was even alert to it. It's fantastic. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. Tries a through ball. And with the goal at his mercy, a dreadful miss. Probably not his best option. I think goalkeepers are, are normally happy for players to have a, a go from there. He put on quite a show there. It's tremendous play on his part, Peter, and he's proving to be a, a right handful throughout the game. Disappointing finish in the end. Foul, free kick's been given. Oh, that's a booking, always looked it. Well, what goes through a player's head at times like that is a mystery to me. He's kept it out, just. Tony Kroos. And the whistle goes for half-time. It's looking very much like game, set and match. A half of ruthless endeavour with a thirst for more. And just in case you think this is bias on my part, it isn't. This is fact. Real Madrid are cruising it at half-time. 3-0 ahead. <laughs> Belts one. Gave it a go, but off target. That's a pretty powerful effort, because he really got hold of that one, but he's not going to trouble the keeper from there. Casemiro... ...passes it through. Tony Kroos... Cristiano Ronaldo! Oh, it's come off the upright! No mistake! Results no longer in doubt. It's just about how many. Oh, you've got to say, the odds on him missing from there were very slim. It's a simple game. A striker's job is to find the space as often as possible, and he did exactly that. Real Madrid totally rampant here. Isco sticks in a foot to win it back. That's good progress he's made on the ball. Where to next? He's a clever pass. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Knocks it towards the front. Who's going to make this theirs? Uh, ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. And he has been fouled there. It's a long ball, but it's not hit its target. the pass this defense just doesn't trust itself to to play a higher line frighten the people getting in behind yeah absolutely it just opens up the opportunity of not only strikers getting behind but the runners from midfield too he 
He's on the move and he's going to have to go it alone. Looking to force his way through. A chance! Who's ball? Who's going to get there? Cristiano Ronaldo is now the subject of some adhesive marking. Yeah, Peter, and it looks like this defence will go tooth and nail to prevent him from, um, from getting another. Isco, and it's Marcelo. Marcelo boots it upfield. Gets up to head it! And couldn't quite steer it on target. Casemiro picks it up from the goal kick. Cristiano Ronaldo, shot at goal! And he steered it beyond the post. Oh, that's great stuff from him. Well, in all honesty, he's tormented that defence. They just can't handle him. That is a poor kick by the keeper. Being intercepted. Looks like a good ball through. Oh, well intercepted. Really alert to the danger. A real chance to break. Four added mates on the board. Tries a through ball. Speculative strike. Oh, impressive strike. It so nearly came off for him. He's been a joy to watch, and, and that didn't miss by much. He'll be back. And time is up. Real Madrid enjoy their perfect day. For their victims, it is entirely imperfect. Comprehensive winners of a one-sided contest. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? Well, tactically, they looked as if they got that spot on. I think when you push up at the back to the extent they did,